to my channel so it is a little bit late at night at the moment but I really wanted to do a quick unboxing of the Hello Kitty Nike Prestos that will be releasing officially here in Australia tomorrow which is the 10th of May and I don't know about you guys but I've been very very excited for this release ever since I saw the images of them first of all because I loved Hello Kitty when I was growing up like I was that kid that wanted Hello Kitty everything and I would make my mom buy me like Hello Kitty towels my bed sheet was Hello Kitty like anything that was Hello Kitty I wanted it so this for me is a very nostalgic thing and also I'm sure you guys know that in 2004 there was supposed to be a Nike Hello Kitty collab and Steven Smith and Hiroshi Fujiwara designed four different colorways of the Nike Hello Kitty Prestos but they never actually released and the rumor has it that they only gave 12 pairs of each colorways to friends and family so they are super super rare and it's one of those sneakers where you actually wonder whether it actually existed if that makes any sense because I've seen photos of it I've never seen one in person but once in a while I think about it and I'm like did I imagine a Hello Kitty release so back in 2004 to celebrate Hello Kitty's 30th anniversary Nike was going to drop the Hello Kitty collab but for some reason it never Happen and 18 years later, we finally have an official Hello Kitty collab. So I have the Prestos here to show you guys. So there's also an apparel range which I do not have. I have my eye on the hoodie as well as the white t shirt. I think that is a definite must cop. I'm going to try and get it on the Nike site tomorrow. I think it's dropping at 5 p.m. the last time I checked. Anyway, I need to set an alarm for that because I always forget. But today we're here to talk about the sneakers. First of all, look at this box. I really love it when collabs do like a special packaging because how cute is this? So you can see there is the classic Hello Kitty bow as well as the Nike swoosh and just the colorway and design of the box is definitely very in line with Hello Kitty's branding and then in here you'll notice that the paper on the box also has the Hello Kitty and Nike co-branding. I really really love this and one more detail that's in the box. Let me take out the shoes to show you guys. Hopefully you can see, but look at this. On the inside of the box, you have a little Hello Kitty and she's winking and I just think that's super, super cute. Again, I may be a little bit biased with these sneakers because I just loved Hello Kitty growing up and I actually think this is a really nice colorway. For me, this is a definite cop because I think it's such a special collaboration and I think there's so many cute details on the sneaker. A lot of my friends think that they're almost too cute for them to rock and I kind of get where you're coming from, but I think it's just a nice pair to keep in your collection even if you don't choose to wear them because like, look at this guys, it is so, so cute. So I want to quickly show you guys the details on the sneaker. Obviously, this is a pair of Air Prestos. I haven't worn Prestos for the longest time. The last pair of Prestos that I really wanted were the Acronym Collab. I think those look so good and a lot of my friends had them and for some reason I didn't cop a pair at that time. I don't know what I was doing but anyway we're here to talk about the Hello Kitty Collab today. So sizing wise these ones come in like actual sizing so um, I think it starts from a men's US 5. I could be wrong. I got mine in a men's US 6 because you guys know that some of the Prestos run in like extra small, small, medium, large. Um, I cannot remember my sizing for Prestos when it comes to that sizing but for these ones here I went true to size so I got it in a men's US 6. I don't believe that they make Prestos in half sizes so if you're in between sizes I think you can go for the half size down. The upper is very stretchy. I'm sure if you guys wear Prestos, you're familiar with that. And the sneaker is just super, super lightweight. Like I said, I haven't worn a Prestos in the longest time. I think the last time I wore a pair of Prestos was maybe like early 2000s. I remember I had this cobalt blue pair. I recently saw a photo of myself wearing it. The fit was not it. <laughs> so I will not show you guys that photos, but I like really remember the Prestos being super, super cool. The Prestos originally came out in the year 2000 and it was designed to be a running sneaker. So you guys can see it is a very, very flexible sneaker. And the upper is again, very flexible and it conforms to your feet. And they are really comfortable. Like I said, it's been a minute since I've worn them, but I am loving them. And let me just show you guys the details 
else. I keep telling you guys that I'm going to show you. But let's start off with the upper. You guys can see it is in this very cute blue colorway with the Hello Kitty print repeated all over the sneaker. On the forefoot here, you can see the Nike branding embroidered in white. And another detail that's Hello Kitty related, which I think is super cute. Here on the heel, you can see there is the five dots. So the two dots are her eyes and they're in the middle here. It is her nose, which I think it is such a low key cute little detail when i saw this i was like oh my gosh this is the cutest and then my favorite part of the sneaker is definitely the heel counter because they have molded it to look like hello kitty so they even have the little ears here and her bow and of course you can see her face i think this is such a nice touch and to me it just makes the sneaker more Hello Kitty than it already is. Another Hello Kitty detail you'll notice is here. You can see that it's a bow. Again, very, very cute. And they've used a white cage. So because the sneaker has sort of a sock-like fit, to give it a little bit more structure, they've included this cage in general, like Presto. So I'm not talking about this particular release, but in terms of the Presto, um, the cage is definitely there to give it some support and also for the laces to go through. Um, the sneaker does not come with any spare laces, but I think the white laces work perfectly. Moving on to the inside of the sneaker, you guys can see it is lined with this really plush velour. It is so nice and comfy. And then you can also see that with the insoles, there is a custom Hello Kitty Nike insoles um, it is glued onto the sneaker so I don't want to take them out but I'll insert a photo so you guys can see but I love that they've included so many cute Hello Kitty details on the sneaker and like I said regardless if you're going to wear them or not if you're a Hello Kitty fan I feel like you should definitely cop them and even if you're not a Hello Kitty fan yeah I think this is such a great pair to just keep in your collection and like Many years from now, you'll be like, do you remember the one time there was that Hello Kitty Nike collab, right? I don't know whether that's just me, but that is how I feel about this collab. I'm just so, so happy that these are finally releasing. Stock allocation wise, I think there are going to be quite a few pairs around. Here in Australia anyway, I think the stock allocation is quite high. So I'm assuming for you guys in the US, Europe or Asia, it shouldn't be too difficult to get your hands in a pair if you're thinking about it. But yeah, I'm just so, so happy that I have them in hand. And I haven't thought about the fit that I want to put together. But I think even if you wear like black and white, these would look really, really cute. Apparel wise, I don't have them at the moment. So I can't really tell you guys about sizing. I assume that they're just your regular Nike sizing so I'm gonna try and get the hoodie in a size medium there's also the sweatpants but I don't know whether I'm gonna go for that because I feel like it's too matchy matchy but it also could look quite cute so we will see and I also really want the white t-shirt because I think the branding is just so on point it looks simple and clean and just it's Hello Kitty guys I really hope I didn't miss out on any details on the sneaker hold on with the laces you guys can see the lace tips here are in red again the Hello Kitty colorway branding with like her face and like the red bow well i don't know what i'm trying to do i'm trying to show you that <laughs> she has like a little bow here but yeah overall i think nike did an amazing job with this collaboration again super nostalgic and thinking back to the 2004 release that one is almost like a myth you know what i mean like that's like the unicorn of sneakers you're kind of unsure whether it existed or not we don't even know anyone who has a pair well i don't know anyone who has a pair anyway i hope this video was somewhat helpful i did talk about sizing so i think they fit true to size and if you're in between sizes then just go for like the smaller of the size so if you're like a six and a half then go for a six if that makes any sense that's what i did anyway and they fit so good on feet and the upper is very very stretchy so i think you should be fine even if you have wider feet but again sizing is quite subjective so if you have any more input in regards to presto sizing just leave it in the description bar below so maybe that would be helpful for other people because it's been a very 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 long time since i've worn a pair of air presto so 
my sizing information may not be super accurate but for me I feel like they fit true to size um, and yeah guys I think that is all I want to tell you guys about the Nike Hello Kitty collab I really hope you guys cop a pair let me know in the comments below what you think about this particular release um, yeah like I said I am biased because I love Hello Kitty so so much and I am just very excited for this release but yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it don't forget to give it a big thumbs up please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you guys really really soon bye